Right guys, I'm playing War Robots on my laptop. Uh, it's got it's an MSI Raider GE 67 HX. Uh, it's got RTX uh, 3080 Ti laptop GPU. It's also set at um, a mobile clock unit MSI after burner, and it's set um, from 1560. Oh, I think it's 1590. Sorry, 1590. Uh, it's set from 1590 to about 2130 uh, overclocking. I do have three overclocks that I can join the laptop, uh, which is the 1745 for 1750. Uh, that's the first overclock that I could do. The other overclock that I can do would be, um, I think it's um, 1750, then 1950, second overclock. The third overclock that I'm using is, the one that I'm actually using, currently using is, um, 21, uh, 22, sometimes it fluctuates 21, 23, uh, but right now it does uh, actually say 21, 30 megahertz. So memory is was set at 8,000. Uh, after the overclock, it's uh, 8,300 megahertz. And of course, um, the, the laptop that I use has its own overclocking, uh, it's got its own overclocking ability so it's it does have a core clock uh, offset of 200 megahertz anyway right so the laptop itself could actually give me a further 200 megahertz but it's just like it's i feel like that's not enough um i mean on the on the memory clock but look at this guy why is he using that robot what's that robot called oh my god <laughs> he is dead i'm like what he's already dead i'm like what's the point of what he was doing. I mean, why use old robots? I'm not saying you shouldn't use old robots. I'm just saying why use them, knowing that you're playing with people with old coaches, OPNs, Dagons. Oh my God, this guy is killing with his lasers, man. Damn, cause a lot of damage there. Ah, uh, so this one I've got um, two on it. Hornets and uh, Tiger Scatters. Oh my god, he's killed my robot. <laughs> he destroyed the robot. Right, this one, I've got two Rustos uh, with lasers. And this is a uh, Fafnir. I'm supposed to be doing damage at 400 meters, but that's not an easy task. Because uh, Fafnir, like I've said in the past, I don't feel Fafnir is uh, as good uh, for up-close battles. But of course, these dudes like the steak so much, man. You know, they love this steak weapon. I don't know why. Look at, look at that. Come on, come on. Come out of stealth. Look at that. And then he's dead. His, his steaks are not helping him. Oh, my God. That took a while to do. Right. So, I'm supposed to be doing damage at 400 meters. And... Oh my god, that's a, a luching door. Oh my god. Oh, wow. Ah, uh, damn. Right. I'm going to use my Indra. Only because, I mean, it's it's a waste of time trying to fight this luching door with robots. So, you know. There you go, he's dead now. He's, he's a goner. Right, so that luching door is gone. I use my Vortex Mothership ability on him and naturally he was not going to last. Uh, so, that, what's this, a Warrior Typhoon? And man, come on, why is no one helping? What's wrong with people? We can win this if we fight as a team. <laughs> no one wants to win. Oh my god, that's a, that's a Rook. Titan. That's a Rook Titan right there. Uh, he's got two claves on him. And uh, oh my god, he's got, he's got a Vajra weapon on him. Oh damn. He's, he's up in the air. Oh wow. I mean, look at this. I'm being attacked by everybody. No one is trying to help me. I just don't understand, man. Why, why do we even fight, play as, as a group here? People should just should 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 not even care about anything. 
people should just be like, why, why do we need to play as a team? Really, why? No, no one cares. No one's coming to, to, to hold your back here or, or hold your hand. I'm like, if we fight as a team, we can win. Stop hiding and think, come here and help. What's wrong with people? Once my titan is gone, that's it, man. There's no defense here. You come here and kill this robot. You know what? That's what I hate about these people. They can easily see. Listen, what I'm saying is, I'm not. If they don't lose a robot, fine. You don't. It's your favorite robot. Whatever. What I'm saying is, come out, fight with these robots. Let's kill this robot quickly together, and then you get your honor points and what whatever skill level they were trying to get. But they don't want to do that. They just want to hide, and then. When, when there's, there's no way to hide, then it's like, oh, now, now we have to fight. Now we have to do something. You had a chance to kill that robot to, to, to do some damage, some serious damage to whatever robots you could have killed. But instead of killing the robot, you chose to hide. You see what I'm saying? You, you, you can get your honor points, even with, with people like me there, right? Because at the end of the day, look at that. He, he now brings his, his Titan out. Why didn't he bring his Titan out that time when I needed him? You see what I mean? This thing of not wanting to use their Titans and keeping their crappy robots, knowing that if they just fought with their robots at that time, we could have at least won. Maybe not... Ah, man. Look at this. Terrible. Now, I'm just saying, it's, it's, really, it's really annoying. When, when I'm pulling out all the punches, I've used all of my good robots to win this match for other people, for ungrateful players that don't want to use their titans. You see, they wait until the last minute, and now look, we're going to lose this. Oh, wait. <laughs> I can only hope that we don't lose. <laughs> they killed the titan at last. But that took a while. Look, look where he's going to land. He's lost his robot. No, he's lost it. Look. Oh, he was going to fall down anyway. Right, so this dude's using what? Oh, I know that weapon. A clave. What's the beta? What's that thing? Oh, that's a, um, a Vajra weapon. And, uh, okay, cool. Right, let me, let me check this dude out. What's he using? Okay, Gargantua and, yeah, okay. And the blindy weapon thing. What is this one? Uh, I'm trying to see the weapons it's got. Uh, they're not that good. Shredders, I think, or something. What weapon is that one? That's a gradual. No, that's a mace, a shotgun weapon. And the top is like a laser weapon or something. What? Oh, this dude was using uh, Zeus weapons. Right. Okay. And that was uh, one of those Seraph uh, robots. Uh, what robot is this one? I know the name of this, but I forget now. He's got one fainter lockdown weapon. He's got a hazard weapon. That's hazardous or something. I mean, radiation weapon. So that's hazard. Uh, what are these? That's blight weapons. So I mean, his, his weapons aren't bad. Uh, but the robot's not that good. Where are the robots? Okay. So we've got a Titan. He's got two, three barges. So he's got good weapons. But he's getting annihilated. That, this, this Titan is not good, man. I don't know why people want to use it. I don't know why people would still use these, uh, these Seraph robots. It's got two Zeus weapons. Those are, they fire every five seconds, these are weapons that it's got. But I mean, why would you use this lightning robot? I call them lightning robots. They're not that good, man. Now look, he's on the ground. He's suffering damage. This dude's coming in with the opium. He's going to destroy those. He's going to destroy the Titans. And look, they, 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 they're taking all the beacons. All the beacons are gone. Oh, look at this guy. He's got that shotgun weapon and he's got a prisma, laser weapon. Nah, that, that, that dude's dead. He's, he's definitely dead. He's, he's a goner now. Eyes on the ground. Eyes gone. <laughs> he's gone. I told you. I know these robots, man. I know them. Look, he's got that. Uh, oh, he's got, okay, he's got Joe weapons. And what's this weapon? Uh, talent. That's a talent, right? Oh my god. So those claws, those are badass weapons. Because those are heat-seeking missiles. That Those missiles, they never miss. And once they get you, you're finished. I'm so disappointed, man. Like, why are these people doing that? 
All right, you know, you know one thing. I was gonna keep the laser weapons. I want to actually take off these uh, MK2 Rastos from this one dude. I'm gonna give them to this robot here. So that means that all the Rastos on him will be MK2. So I mean, that means more fire output. You you understand? So there's no problem there. Um, so he's got MK2 now. So he's got good firepower. Now with this dude, I want to take off the laser weapons. I want to give him something with a bit more consistency. Let's see, like the jaws. Wait, I've got Rastos with this guy. I've got jaw. Jaw is what? 350 meters. Yeah, that might be an issue. But I, I, want, I want to check, actually. Let me check. Let me see. I mean, I might as well check them out because I took the weapons off other robots. I mean, there'll, there'll be no point in just removing the, the weapons without testing them. And you know what I mean? I mean, you're saying 350, which isn't fantastic, but I mean, I want to test them out. So he's got Razdos, MK2s, and he's got Jaws. But I do have, I've got four more Razdos. I've got four more. Check this out, four more Razdos. So if those don't do much, I can also put Rastos on this, um, on that uh, robot, on the corrupted Fafnir. Uh, why am I using Fafnir? Because Fafnir is the only robot that can fly uh, for extended period of time in the air. Uh, the other reason is uh, because of the durability not being good. Uh, it also means that I'm not going to be up close and personal with the enemy robot. You know what I mean? So I'm keeping my distance away from enemy robots. So that's why. That's how I'm using the Fafnir's. Uh, the Crimson Hawks, uh, the, the inbuilt, inbuilt weapons do damage at 500 meters. Uh, damn, this guy, Mars, is throwing his uh, remote assault over. I hate these dudes, man. You know, at one time, I mean, I've got two Mars uh, robots myself. I get why people use them, because they, they don't want to fight up close and personal. They want to fight from a distance. It's okay. It's all good. Until someone gets you from the back or has got um, an opium and just... Oh, my God. What's this guy doing? Oh, my God. He's causing so much damage. Why doesn't this guy attack him? He's just running away. Don't run away. Don't try and create distance. Hit the dude. Oh, he's got the retro reapers. Okay, I see. Right. Okay, I understand. But those reapers are, are badass. Those reapers do cause a lot of damage. I don't understand people that hide away with the reapers. Those reapers cause a lot of damage. He's got four of them. He's got four reapers. Okay, he doesn't want to die. I get that. But what's the point in, in you then hiding? If you're going to hide with your reapers, then why are you playing the game? I don't understand people, man. Ah, damn, I'm losing my robot yet. I'm done, just going to back off. I've got four MK2 uh, Rastos. So these are the bendy bullet type. They do cause a lot of damage, but these only cause damage... Um, how can I put this? After... You know, the thing about the Rasto weapon... If you want it to cause a lot of damage, don't consistently press on them, you know? They're like... You see, I'm going to do more damage now, because this dude here, uh, my Rasdos were fully loaded. So the best thing to do with the Rasdos is don't, don't, do not just attack... Like, like here, I'm, I'm just spraying this dude here, my Rasdos. But I do have the other Rastos that are fully loaded. Uh, I do want to do some kind of damage. Uh, from, okay, this dude here. I don't want to disturb whatever he's doing. But I want to get in. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. We need to move away from this place. Oh shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at that. He lost his robot. <laughs> I can't believe it. Ah, oh, damn. He, he came in from behind thinking he could do some damage and he's dead now. He's gone. Right, right. Let's see. Let's see what we can do there. 
right this tube is just perching up there you don't need to do that buddy what's this thing is that an opium i do not want to fight an opium he will he will definitely destroy my robot ah he's landed all right cool he's, he's now easy catch let's destroy this dude forget about anyone else kill that dude honestly that's an opium oh my god is that another opium ah i've lost my robot not too pleased right so that's a surf robot man the more and more i, I want to do damage from the distances that i want to do damage from the more impossible it just gets to play the game oh wow we lost <laughs> I can't believe it. I mean, we tried though, right? We did try. Just uh, unfortunately, it didn't make it. Let's see. I know that it's not going to be good now. Okay, it's saying 1.4 million damage. Wow. I only got 600,000 and then I've, I've completed that task, you know? So that's good, man. You see, that's why I said they, these are not bad. Oh, I didn't get to use the, the other corrupted Fafnir. So I didn't get to see what the, that one was going to be doing. I need permission to show images from your Google Photos account. Showing your photo memories. Right, let's see. Right, so this is a Clinton Hawk. I got two Hornet weapons and Tiger Scatters. Those are some weapons. After I complete this task, I'm going to be playing uh, War Robots Frontiers. Uh, Frontiers is a good game. It's really good. It's created by the same creators as War Robots. But um, how can I put this? I think War Robots Frontiers needs more maps. Two maps is not enough. Uh, I know, I know, it's still in, it's still in development. They're still building up the game, but uh, two maps is not enough. Uh, the other thing they need to do is they need to increase the rewards slightly. I mean, it takes a really long time to to gain some rewards, you know. So it takes a long time to gain rewards. It would be nicer if you, you know, like you see, like this war robots. When you're playing it, you get silver, you get gold, and um, if you complete certain tasks, you get some platinum. With frontiers, they're trying to do the same thing, but they're not doing enough. I think they, it's like lacking a bit. They're not doing enough because I mean, man, you be playing that game. Like me, I've been playing that game like for about four, four or five matches in the game, only to discover that I've I've not accumulated that you know like a lot a lot through the matches. You know what I mean? So I'm playing a match on War Robots Frontiers. Like I said, three four matches I'm playing the game, and what have I accumulated in terms of In terms of like gold or whatever whatever I was supposed to be getting you know what I mean it's 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 very kind of frustrating when you're playing a game for a long period of time and you're not really getting much uh, in terms of rewards for the game and then the the creators of the game they don't create more maps for the game I'm thinking if you don't create more maps who's gonna play this game no, I'm being serious, because if, if you don't create maps, a lot of maps for the game, then who's going to play? I'm going to use the Rustles now, and hopefully they'll bend and hit this guy. Right, so I want to maintain my 400 meter distance. And you see, so these Rustles are actually good for this uh, distance thing, you see? So within 400 meters, I'm able to maintain the 400 uh, meter distance with the Rustle weapons. I think, what is he using? Is that, is that a Fafnir? Oh my god, he had a Fafnir as well, but he knocked mine out. So, 
I'm gonna use my other five here. I wish these jaws, like these uh, jaw weapons, would fire at a distance of 400 meters. Unfortunately, they only do 350. But I think they're, they're, they're actually hitting that dude. They're actually hitting him. Right, you see what I like about the Fafnir? Look at that. I'm maintaining the 400 meter distance and attacking this dude. You see, that's what I was talking about. With the Fafnir, you can do this. You can maintain the distance. I just attacked the person from 400 meters. You can't do this with any other robot. You see, I'm just staying within that 400 meters. And the fact is that with the Fafnir as well, I'm, I'm just flying, I'm up in the air, flying around. No one was noticing me, but now this guy is attacking me. Why? Why are you doing that? You disturbed my whole shindig. I was enjoying myself. <laughs> really enjoying myself. I was just attacking this dude from 400 meters, enjoying myself completely, you know, not a care in the world. And then this guy starts attacking me. I'm like, why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? What's that thing? Is that a titan? Ah, oh, damn it. That's a titan. I didn't notice. <laughs> I'm going to use my last crimson orc now. That's a rope titan, by the way. A rook titan in the background right there. Right, I'm gonna try and destroy this robot if I can. Nope, that did not work out. I'm gonna use my Indra Titan now. Okay, so that's a Brook Titan. Let me send him to back to the stars. There you go, Titan Slayer. Got me Titan Slayer. Right, so I'm going to use the stealth ability because the stealth ability actually allows my titan to move a whole lot faster. What the hell is this thing? How's a Sharanga? Sharanga. I'm using my orient ability on him as well. Sharanga. I do have a Sharanga, I think. I, oh my god. <laughs> Wow! I was crazy, man. I was crazy. Oh my god. It wasn't the Sharanga that got me though. It's one of those, uh, it was a warrior typhoon that, that took me out. This one. With these weapons. These, um, those weapons are quite good. You know? It knocked me out. Oh my god. I tried though. I tried. Right, I, I just want to see how much damage I've done now because I was able to maintain with the Fafni, I was, remember I was up in the air, I was able to maintain that uh, 400 meter distance. Oh, you see, look, I finished it, I completed it. I told you, with the Fafni, I did it as well. Right, so the next one it says capture beacons in victorious battles. This one is going to be simple. Check this out. I've done it, I did it, guys. So that means I'm getting a uh, data pad. Nice. The next data pad is at level 9. Right, let's see. When does this end? Ends in one day, 15 hours. So all I got to do with this one, it's saying that to capture 6. I need to capture. How many is that? Is that 8 or 6? It looks like 6, but to my mind, it's like 8. And it doesn't matter. Capture beacons in victorious battles. You know what I'm going to use? I want to show you what I'm going to use. Uh, oh no, I, I moved him. I've got a Loki. I'm gonna use a Loki for that one. 